morning everybody um, get ready to go check some sets uh, we're gonna get rolling and uh, hopefully we got something today uh, yeah so far I've got uh, one coyote um, two skunks and a rabbit yeah had to think there for a second um, I have what one two five sets out something like that um, so I don't have many sets out but uh, that's just how it goes so yeah we're gonna go check these sets I'm gonna move a couple of them today uh, maybe I'll show what I'm doing and how I'm gonna make the sets and stuff so uh, yeah hopefully we got a got us a coyote or two that'd be cool but well we're gonna we're gonna pray here and then we're gonna get on down the line and see what we got so all right here we go dear lord we thank you for this opportunity to get out and do a little trapping and enjoy uh enjoy nature um thank you for your love and mercy to us every day i pray that you would just be with everyone out there that is watching this bless them and keep them safe and help them um just keep us all today and, and may we please and honor you Ask these things in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, guys. Well, we're going to, um, yeah, head on down the line. So hopefully I'll get to show you a coyote or two. That'd be cool. All right, later. All right, so we're down here checking sets. Um, and this is the spot where I caught that coyote the other day. Um, right here. Now what I did is I moved just off the catch circle and I had just punched some holes in underneath um, the ground lake and put some um, lure in two different holes right there and my trap is right here okay um, so what this coyote has done two nights in a row now he came in and he dug here okay the first night he came in actually three nights last night he didn't well last night he did the night before he didn't do nothing but anyways he come in and he worked this set right here had just a little scratch the night before well what I did is I come back again with some of our um, crap from our dogs and I stuck a pile of it right there. There's still some of it there, but he came back last night and worked this set again. Like I said, my pan's right, right there. Um, so he's working the set. Looks like he's working the set from here, right in this way, um, by his diggings. Uh, so I don't know. I think I might take a little, just a small something. I'm going to put right here to try and get him to come over this way and work the set. Um, but I'm just going to leave that go. Now I'm coming over here. Right here and putting a set in. I did have this set up on top of the hill where I caught the skunk. Um, and uh, I pulled that one. That one wasn't... I, I was on the downwind side of that. And I wasn't real keen on that. Um, but what I'm going to do here, I'm not doing much. I'm just putting that little backing right there. I'm going to take and put uh, some uh, gland lure uh, right there in one hole. And some glands, just regular coyote glands that I collected in another hole underneath that. And I'll give it just a couple drops of urine. Um, I don't have much urine. So I'm kind of being sparing with this. I want to move a couple of my other sets um, to another spot today. Um, so I'm trying to be sparing with what urine I have. So I'm just going to put a couple drops of urine right on there. And I'm going to put my set right there. And blend it in good. And we'll just see what happens. Um, hopefully we'll uh, nab this critter. So, Alright, well I'll, I'll show you this when I'm done. Alright, later. Alright guys. <coughs> Excuse me. There's uh there's our set. Um 
show you this little better. I kind of got like this nice little trail comes right in. It can come in real nice and easy. Um, I squared a little bit of lower, or not lower, yarn on that little chunk of wood and stuck some in a hole, stuck some uh, uh, glands, uh, just coyote glands that I had ground up and put down in there. Um, my trap is right uh, right in there. So right there's that. Put some scratch marks here like another coyote come in. And uh, yeah, there's the there's a set. Now this one that he's been working, um, I just come over and I pulled this um, piece of wood that was up here. Like I said, he's been coming in this this way and working the set, and that little piece there was up here. So all I did is pulled that down. It's been here. You know, he he's not afraid of that. Um, it's like something else come in and was digging around and, and dug that down. So hopefully that will get him to step over this way and into the set. So, all right. Well, we are going to uh, get going and uh, head down and, and move a couple other sets and make some new sets. And, um yeah, just redo some stuff. So I'll show that stuff as I as I get rolling here. So all right, catch you later. Alright guys, so we're up here at this other set. Um we're getting ready to go back in and uh I had let's see I had four sets up here. I caught a rabbit in one and a deer in another. Um and so I pulled them. I wouldn't have had to re-pull the one with the deer, but I did anyways. Um, and then uh, I still have those two up there. So we're going to go check them and then pull them and bring them down this way a little bit further. And at a new spot. And uh, I'll show you those, those sets that I'm going to make. I just wanted to say something too. Um, i got to give a special thank you to uh, our dear friend of ours Pat for allowing me to borrow his four-wheeler um, Pat I can't thank you enough for for allowing us to use this thing um, it's been such a lifesaver and it allows me to get out and do some trapping and stuff so Pat I, again I really really appreciate uh, appreciate you letting us use this thing so all right guys well we're gonna get up here get this done and uh, I'll show you the sets all right okay guys so no coyotes up when we went and checked them um, so like I said I pulled them from up up on the other end of this little clearing to this end and I'll show you what we got um, we got this road that runs through and down through there. I'm um, down that away. And then we got now these are deer trails, but I know the coyotes use them. You know, the trail goes right up through there. There's uh, another trail comes out of there. Another trail comes out of there. Um, yeah, up here a little bit, right in through them trees, be a good place for a snare. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I might end up putting a snare in there. I don't know. But um, there's a trail comes out of there. Um, I know the coyotes come through here. So this is what we got here. Um, this is a yarn post set. Right in there's my set. Um, sticks out a little more than what I'd like to, but it's not too bad. Um, right there on the end of that stick, right there, right in there, um, I have. Uh, just yarn on some uh, sheep's wool and I also have um, cabins uh, or cavens however you want to say it I'm not sure how they say it but everybody says it different um, yodel dog on that on the end of that stick there and then I just put some scratches in here like a coyote come in here and scratched 
pissed and scratched there so that's that yarn post set and then over here we have a double dirt hole um, I'd show you what I used in a different bait I put bait in here and lure on that one and bait in this one um, the bait on this one is also has a lot of caster in it so that's kind of a lure all by itself there too and then the trap itself sits right in between these two holes so if I come in and work either direction any of these sets I can I'll nail him so and that's you know it's kind of a, a low spot in there you can't see it real well but it's kind of a low spot there because a nice uh, landing spot so yeah and then there's also over here um, coming off this Logan Road and stuff there's trails go up through that away too so and like I said I've seen I know I've seen coyotes back here um, I uh, I've uh, there was uh, one pissed right up here and scratched one pissed over there and scratched it could have been the same dog but you know so they, they're they're coming through they're coming through here so well guys I gotta keep rolling here um, I got gotta go to work so um, yeah but uh, thanks for joining me and hopefully everybody's doing well out there and I guess uh, We'll check these tomorrow and see what we get, and hopefully uh, we'll have us uh, have us a coyote. So, all right, guys, take care. God bless. We'll catch you later.